Hi guys, welcome to Code Artisan Lab. So this is our 15th video for Django tutorial series. And in this series, we are creating a question answer website. So in this, in our previous video, we have created the tag page in which when we click on the particular tag, then it will fetch the questions according to the tag. And we also modified our home page. We are showing comments and answers. We are uh, showing comments and uh, answers count. So now in this video, we will work on user profile section and uh, we will extend the default user model. We will uh, extend this uh, user model which comes with Django and we will create our custom user model. So let's do this. So now I will open my project and I will open the application and I will open the models.py file. And here I will create the custom user model with the help of abstract user. So the first thing I need to do, I need to fetch the abstract I need to fetch the abstract user and I am uh, getting this uh, abstract user from the contrib auth models. Now here I will create the custom user model. Class custom user and here I will define the now we have a multiple options to create user profile a page. We can also uh, create you profile or a user profile model and attach with the uh, user model with the foreign key relationship. But I will prefer the abstract user. I will prefer the custom user model uh, to extending the abstract user. So now what I will do, I will create here profile I will create here bio equal to models dot not bio I will create the okay it's fine bio models dot text field and I will get the location equal to models dot models dot character field the character field will be maximum length equal to 200 so now i am over adding the i am extending the user model now we need to use this custom user model uh, in the place of user model so what i will do i will copy this so with the help of this abstract user uh, class you can extend the you can create the custom user model so now I will relate this with this model custom user and here I will copy and now we need to uh, we need to run the migration and uh, then we will migrate the uh, migrate our newly created model so before migrating we need to do you need to do something because we have already using the user model now we have created the custom user and attached the custom user with our uh, a question model answer model but now the migration will not work because we need to delete the all all previous migrations and we need also delete the this uh, database this db.sqlite file so I will delete this and I will also delete the migration and now we need to define the in our setting.py file I will define the auth user model because default you we are not working with the default user model so that we need to define the user model so I will define custom user. 
so this is custom user so now let's migrate this py manage dot py make migration and now migrate so I have migrated this now keep in mind that we have also deleted the admin a uh, user so we need to add the admin user so what i will do i will create the manage.py create super user create super user admin enter admin and password is it's all right So let's check this. So I will check this in open the admin and admin. admin. So now you can see here we don't have any user model here because we have not registered the custom user model. Now our user model is actually custom user model. So what I will do, I will open the admin.py file and register the custom user here uh, you don't need to delete the uh, migrations file and the sqlite file always this is a particular case because i have already created the user model and i have already attached the data with the user model so that i have deleted the uh, default user model because of I have created custom mod, custom user after the default user model so that I have deleted this so now I will admin dot site dot register now let's check this then server Oh, oh actually we have not user actually it is custom user sorry sorry so here you can see we have a users model and we have a user and uh, at the bottom you can see we have a bio and location field so now we will create a profile we will create a form for the edit profile and show the form when user click on the profile so let's log in i have already logged in so what i will do i will uh, logged out as a admin from the admin site and i will log in from the front end site okay so now we have a profile option we have a profile option because we have deleted the all data so that no question is showing so now we will work on profile then we, we can add some questions so let's uh, work on profile so what i will do i will open the forms.py file and here i will create the form profile form and here i will use the model custom user model and here i will use the field i will use first name and i will use the last name and i will use the username and i will also use the like bio and the location also okay and now we will show this form so open our views.py file and create so i will create profile and here i will define def profile 
and now we will render this uh, okay we will create the form form equal to so we will import the form here here profile form file form and uh, here we will use this form and return render request and i will create the form in the same folder in which login and registration is exist so here i will use profile and in the profile i will pass the form form okay and here i will also pass the instance so because we have logged in so we have a request dot user so i will pass the instance so it will get the data from the current uh, for the current user in the form so here i will create the profile file profile dot profile dot html and in the profile dot html i will copy this i will copy the login page uh, code user profile okay edit profile it's fine edit profile edit profile so actually we are creating edit profile page here i will get the submit so we are okay and one thing more we need to create we need to define the url for this edit profile so i will define this as a account section and here i will define the comment profile here i will define the profile profile file okay so let's check this and we need to also modify the base.html template as well as our home template okay i will this template i will profile here i will put the accounts and copy this link in the home i have uh, created this both uh, i have not defined the base uh, base template in the, for the home because in the home we have a different style of search so so that i have created the home page separately so profile So let's check this okay we have uh, some kind of we need to define the fields we have defined the fields let's check the admin forms fields we have a uh, fields okay let's move this and let's run the restart the server okay now we can so let's go to the profile so it is saying that template does not exist registration profile.php so let's check this we have created registration profile.html i need to define this file.html so let's refresh this okay so you can see here we have a admin uh, uh, this field is pre filled because we have passed the instance so now let's fill this like uh, admin like uh, i will uh, add um, code here i will add artisan and i this is code artisan lab location india summit so because we have not uh, worked on the functionality that when we submit them what we will do so let's create the functionality to save the data so here what we will do if request dot method equal equal to post then we need to define the form we need to profile form equal to so here i will I will pass the data request dot post and instance and now 
we will define if profile form dot is valid then we will what we will do we will save this dot save and we will show the message so i will copy this message and save here change the data file has been updated okay so profile has been updated and now we need to show this so here we will we will ask from the ask question i will check i will get this loop i will copy this loop and paste it here okay so let's check this so what i will code artisan so here i will i am code artisan lab india c so you can see here we have a profile has been updated and now we have a first name last name username and all the things we have already filled because we have uh, submitted this data and fetched the data in the in we have submitted this data and fetched the data with the help of instance with the help of current user so we have created the edit profile so let's uh, now we will in the next section in the next video i will create the page for the user profile in which i will show the questions of a question that submitted the user answer that some uh, that submitted by the user comments and we will also create our last page is also pending we will create the tag page in which we will count the question according to the tags so these two or three things are pending and uh, almost our project is complete so please uh, comment your ideas for project in the comment section and subscribe this channel if you not subscribed then please subscribe this channel and please like this video share this video thank you so much